Hi guys! I am here to help you kung paano nga ba mag-renew ng PRC License ID 2023 based on my experience. So, let's go! So, bago po tayo pumunta ng PRC para sa ating renewal ng ating license card, make sure tayo ay nakapag-register and make online appointment. Take note guys, hindi po sila tumatanggap ng walk-in applicant. So, make sure nakapag-online tayo at nakapag-register na din, okay? So, paano nga ba mag-register at make appointment online? It's so easy. Alright, make sure that you will visit the prc.gov.ph Make sure na legit na website ha at click Liris. So after natin mag-click yung Liris account guys, mapupunta tayo sa page na register and sign in. So dahil meron na akong account, kailangan ko lang mag-sign in using my email address and password. At kapag wala pa kayong account, make sure to register your information. Okay? Para makapag-appointment tayo. So, this is it guys, my PRC Lurist account. So, dito ako mag-schedule ng aking appointment. Alright, so nakapaglagi na tayo sa ating account guys. But, hindi ko po may pakita sa inyo kung paano ako nag-select appointment kasi nakapag-appointment na po ako ahead of time. But, let me just give you some information that... Um, you need to click select transaction on your account and click the profession for example me professional teacher you need to fill out your um, PRC license number and after that um, you need to click the or choose the location kung saan ka malapit for me I choose PRC Mandawi main branch dito sa Subang Dako, Mandawi, Cebu City so I need to click the time kung saan ko gusto at you know, convenience sa aking free time, so after that hindi po siya libre guys ha yung renewal, akala ko nga free but you need to pay the renewal fee and how much it is so the renewal fee is just only only <laughs> 450 and it is valid for three years so for you need to pay 450 and it is valid for three years guys and after that you need to renew your license after three years again okay but the prc cebu um doesn't accept a over-the-counter payment so you need to pay this one online and i'll show you guys what are the payment available for online so guys, these are the following payment channel na accepted on PRC payment online. We have the May Maya Visa Credit and Debit Card, also the Banknet, Land Bank, and GCash. So sa aking appointment, I use credit card. Yay! Congratulations guys! Tapos na tayong makapag-appointment online. Tapos na tayong magbayad at ito na ang ating um, reference number or confirmation sa ating payment guys. So please see the picture below as the reference. Okay? So ano nga ba mga requirements na kailangan nating dalhin sa pagpunta ng PRC? Alright guys, these are the three major requirements that you need to bring sa pagpunta ng PRC branch para sa yung appointment day. First is you need to bring the print out application form na makikita sa yung Liris account. Okay? You need to print it out. Just only one copy and attach your signature. Second is bring your old PRC ID. Third is your CPD units or your certificates, guys. So for me, since this is my first time to renew my license, so kaya hindi pa ako required to have my CPD units. So kapag meron ka ng CPD units, guys, required ka na niya, so just bring all the certificates, okay? those are the requirements guys na needed mong dalhin sa PRC of course you need to bring yourself pera pamasahe pang snacks after at extra ball pen na rin okay so come and join with me guys my journey to renew my license let's go Just to have my PRC renewal, okay? 
these are my requirements guys my old id my application form at saka yung payment ko dito ako nag-submit ng akong requirements sa counter 6 at waiting ako tawagin ang aking name for the next step and process so while waiting guys imut-imut muna ang person okay check if okay lang tayo charot so after 2 minutes pupunta ako sa releasing of PRC ID after that yay <laughs>